In 2 Timothy chapter 2, we find the phrase able to teach. Now, when I say able to teach, you probably are almost immediately thinking of the best teacher you've ever had in your life. Maybe it's a fifth grade teacher, maybe it's a third grade teacher, maybe it's someone in high school, maybe it's someone in college who communicated to you in a way you got it. You said, that person was a really good teacher. That's not what this word says. This word, when it comes to sharing the word, both what we believe and what we should do with other people who are in need, okay, I notice immediately that this word is surrounded by character words. By the way, notice in verse 24, it says in the Lord's servant, down in verse 25, it says God may perhaps, and down in verse 26, it says they may come to their senses. There's three individuals working here. It's not just about us getting the truth across. It's about us communicating the truth. It's about God's spirit generating something in the person's life. And because they're caught captive by the devil, it's about God releasing them. We're a part of it, but we're not all of it. And when we think we're all of it, moms and dads, we become pretty passionate, maybe even, I might say, manipulative in trying to protect and guard and get our children to do what we want them to do. Listen, we're just a part of it. We're not all of it. 